he was the first duck to ever make it big as a recording artist. But behind all the glitz and glamour is a life filled with personal struggles and emotional turmoil. Join us as we explore the duck behind the sunglasses. Ugly Cool released his debut album, Ducky in Love, and it went straight to number one. He was finally where he wanted to be. Tell me about Ugly Cool, what do you love about him? Yeah, I had almost everything I'd ever wanted, except for one thing. That one thing that Ugly Cool is talking about, but our camera ran out of film before he said what it was and we didn't realize until it was too late, was Beauty Lake. I think Ugly always loved Beauty. She was his childhood sweetheart. and Now that he was rich and famous, she wanted him too after ignoring him for the last 20 years. If that's not the sign of true love, I don't know what is. Shakespeare, eat your mother ah. heart out. It was the fairy tale of the millennium. Ugly and Beauty got married in Tahiti in a private ceremony in front of 100 reporters. They then shared a night of intimate lovemaking, also in front of 100 reporters. But unbeknownst to her new husband, Beauty was addicted to the most dangerous substance known to poultry, quack, also known as flappy quacky, or ecstasy, or by its scientific name, bread. And it wasn't long until Beauty introduced Ugly Cool to this lethal substance. A lot of people don't realize that it's an illness. Everywhere I go, I'm known as the woman who got ugly cool into quack. But I didn't force the shit down his throat, he made a choice. But things took a dark turn when one night in their penthouse suite, both off their beaks on quack, Beauty gave birth to their first egg, only for them to boil it and eat it in an omelette. <laughs> Again. Again, even. I don't remember it, but I know it happened. I ate my own egg. I'm disgusted at this thing. The worst part is, we were so high, I couldn't even finish the omelet. <laughs> Unable to move past what had happened, Ugly and Beauty decided to get a messy divorce that lasted several agonizing years and went their separate ways. Five more marriages and seven trips to rehab later, and the king of music was back. Yeah! Nothing's gonna stop this train! Ugly Cool is the greatest artist of all time! A visionary! Women love me! Men wish they could be me! The only way is up! It's nothing but good things from now on!